Today, I will show you how to use the automated schedule Excel template. So we'll first go into the category list input and add a new category. Let's call it demo category. All right. We'll then go into add delete event and let's create a demo event. We don't need to put any detail here. We will assign it to our newly created category. For the date, let's say 1st of June 2020, and we'll make it start at 8 o'clock and end at 11. Now we just need to click on Add to Calendar, and a little pop up window will show that the event has been added successfully. Now, let's say I've changed my mind and I actually want to um, delete this event. I'm just going to search and delete, and we'll search the word demo, because this is how we called our event. You can see here it comes up in the list. We just need to select it, delete event. It'll come up with a pop-up window asking you if you're sure. Just hit yes, and that's it. The event is now gone from the list. So let's re-add it. Let's say I wanted to change the date and put it on the third. Let's go back and add it to calendar. And that's it. We can go and check into the event list. Let's say we want to look for all the events under the newly created category called demo category. And you can see that our newly created event is right there. We can also see it from the calendar. Comes up on the third right here. To see different months in the calendar, you can also just toggle between next month and previous month. We can also visualize it in the weekly calendar. right here. And finally, we'll go onto the dashboard, select our month, and here is our demo category with our three-hour event that we just created. All right, enjoy.